Hi, this is Shiva Rajaya from VitalCoaching.com. We are talking about vital sex and tantric sex, and the topic for this video is what is the difference between vital sex and tantric sex. You see that I'm using both terms in the videos or in my website, and uh, I just want to give you a couple of hints here. So um, first I was using the word Tantra, and then I realized that Tantra is of course much vaster than the Neo-Tantra interpretation that is in the West. You know, when you go back to India, it's like Tantra is really a vast field of practices, belief systems, etc. that have nothing to do with sex. So um, slowly I started evolving and calling my, my practices related with, uh, with sexual energy that are connected with the Tantra, I call them Tantric sex. And then uh, this evolves one step further because, uh, you know, there are lots of practices that, that are not actually limited to the Tantra field. Uh, for instance, if you are somebody who feels a little bit challenged by the word Tantra or by the word Yoga, it doesn't mean that you cannot practice these things. So um, to reach a wider audience within the West, I have the feeling that sometimes using the word vital sex rather than Tantric sex might be uh, more adapted or more appropriate. So I'm playing with both, you know, it's not really, there isn't really a, a huge difference between those two concepts. I would say that except that in the, in the tantric sex, there might be um, maybe a dimension of ritual or a connection with the, the, the concepts of Shiva and Shakti, the, the dimension of um, devotion in it as well, maybe a little bit more. But even that, you know, it's, it's kind of uh, blurry and it merges very much. So if you hear me saying, tantric sex or vital sex and you prefer to use one or the other terms, feel free to do so. There isn't really, in my own uh, mind, a fundamental difference. I'm just playing with both, both terms the way I feel like. Okay, that's it for now. Bye-bye.